Couple leave kids with babysitter. Then they call the cops after checking baby monitor. Being a parent is perhaps one of the most enjoyable and rewarding jobs life has to offer. There are few things better than being able to nurture a life you helped create and watch him or her grow up to be an independent person on their own. But like any other job, there are times where you need a break and an opportunity to just walk away from it all for a bit. This is where having a good babysitter comes essential. McKenna Newell was the entrusted babysitter in this story, but when the couple left her alone with their twin babies and decided to check the secret nanny cam they had installed, they were absolutely horrified by what it had captured. A couple in West Jordan, Utah, had decided to make plans for a dinner date. A few months prior, the couple had just welcomed a beautiful pair of twins into the world. Having one baby is difficult enough, but having two at the same time definitely turned their worlds upside down, but in a good way. The couple had finally felt comfortable enough to leave their babies with a babysitter. It's very common for new parents, especially the one parent that typically stays at home all day taking care of their babies, to develop a very strong bond and never want to leave their baby's side for fear that something bad could happen. But that barrier had finally been broken, and some one-on-one -on -one date night action was long overdue for the couple. Being responsible, the couple decided to plan this date a few weeks in advance so that they could take the time and find the perfect babysitter to trust leaving their twin babies with. After going through countless babysitting ads and reading reviews for each one, the couple finally came across who they thought would be the perfect choice. They chose to go with 21-year-old McKenna Newell. McKenna had very positive reviews from multiple babysitting clients. She was often described as very professional, punctual, and overall a great person that absolutely adored children and babies of all ages. She also lived very close to the couple's home, which made the arrangement for both parties even more optimal. After a brief phone interview to book the time slot in advance, the couple quickly decided to move forward with hiring McKenna Newell for the job. If only McKenna was as perfect as the reviews made her out to be. Shortly before McKenna was scheduled to arrive at the couple's home, the father still felt a bit anxious about leaving the baby's home. He decided to set up a hidden nanny cam in the living room of their home so that they could periodically check in on the twins to see what they were up to and how everyone was doing. He placed the camera behind the TV so that it was very well hidden. The camera also came with an app that can be installed on a smartphone so that anyone with the app synced to the camera can watch what the camera captures in real time. Shortly after the camera was installed and the couple was set to leave for their date, McKenna arrived and was ready to take over watching the twins so that the parents could step out for a much needed break from parenthood. The couple said their goodbyes to the twins and then they were on their way. The date was going very well. Both parents were genuinely enjoying their time away from the house and break from the twins. But like any parent can relate to, they began to miss their little bundles of joy. The father thought it would be a good idea to access the nanny cam from his smartphone so that the couple could see how their babies were doing. When the camera was accessed and the footage could be seen, the couple was immediately horrified by what they saw. One baby was seen left on the floor crying, the other baby was being walked around in McKenna's arms, then shaken, then placed on the floor next to the other crying baby. McKenna then threw a blanket over the crying twins, then proceeded to place various objects on top of the babies while they were underneath the blanket. After seeing that, the couple quickly paid the restaurant bill, called the police, and drove home as fast as they could. 